Hi guys, our walk this morning starts from this church called St. Francis Xavier. It is located in a suburban area of Singapore called Serangoon Gardens, which has quite a long history. These houses here easily cost more than 2 million Singapore dollars. over Singapore, you will find pavement like this for pedestrians. You are allowed to ride your bicycle on it. So you can say Singapore is very pedestrian friendly. This is one of the few single-storey houses in this estate. This suburban area started with single-storey houses but new buyers developed them and built two or three stories. That is, they rebuilt the whole house, demolished the house and rebuilt. You see the double yellow line? That means there is no parking at all times of the day. You can't even wait. If you wait too long, along double yellow lines is considered illegal parking. A very nice bus stop. Singapore is very well connected by buses all over the island. I read a report which says Singapore bus transport is the best in the world. You see this house, this house here? It's been rebuilt. Hey, cars in Singapore must be the highest price in the whole world. This Mercedes GL250 probably costs around Singapore 
$140,000 Singapore dollars This is the view of that suburban area called Surangun Garden from an overhead bridge. This overhead bridge is sheltered. It's quite long. It spans an expressway And it links this private estate in the suburban area with the public housing area in Singapore. The majority of Singaporeans, 80% or so, live in public housing like what you see here. Now is the morning rush hour, the usual morning uh, traffic. You are looking in the direction of the city or downtown. This expressway is called the Central Expressway. Okay, let's take a walk over to the other side where the majority of Singaporeans live and I'll show you what life is about over there. 